So Jason and Michaela, one of the one of the things that I was excited about on the way in to joining the Lipper team is the massive focus on business as a force for good. And my understanding is every year we kind of make sure we pause and take stock of everything that we're grateful for in, in that area. And certainly it seems like 2022 was the best year yet from that perspective. Yeah, most definitely. We launched a lot of new initiatives and had great team member participation in all of our events and getting out and giving back to the community. Awesome. And Jason, I know one, one of the big things is it's not just that we do it, but it's why we do each of the activities we do in, in this area. So do you want to just tell a little bit in your mind, why is this such a focus for you? Well, there's a lot of reasons, Adam. I think, you know, the big one is what we found through all of our surveys over the years, and certainly since we've been on the culture journey, is that values matter. Serving is one of our values. Team members want a purpose around here. Um, coming to work every day is great. Coming to work to a great place is good. Uh, but man, when you can add on all the serving opportunities that we have and all the things that we do for the community and our team members, it's, it makes being here that much more amazing. I know we're really big on setting lofty goals and, and beating those goals. So there was a goal I know that 100,000 hours of community impact. How'd that turn out? We were end of the year over 150,000 hours. So team members again stepped up, got involved, were engaged with their communities and it shows through the numbers. So Jason, in, in addition to just the sheer staggering number of hours that have been devoted to this, there's also some pretty impressive growth in terms of the scope of the locations. You wanna talk a little bit about that? One of the things I'm most proud of is uh, the, the work that we're doing in Europe. Two continents, six countries. Again, you talk about the ripple that's going to happen you know, domestically in, in Europe as a result of all the work that we're doing here. It's just, it's, uh, it's incredible. And on that note, it's not just that we keep doing more. Uh, we keep responding to what the new needs are and, and coming up with new initiatives. Anything you want to highlight that was, was launched new in 2022? Yeah, we are so excited that we were able to partner with more than 40 companies in the RV industry um, to start the first ever RVIA Emerging Leaders Park Improvement Initiative. So what that's all about, we worked with the RVA board to come up with an initiative that could bring organizations, companies closer together in the industry. And I'd like to say it's a lot because we started the, the serving initiative to begin with. That was just one of the things that that led to this great event that you and a host of other RV uh, industry leaders came up with. And Adam, you asked what, what else is new this year. We launched a serve initiative in October and what the serve initiative is, is uh, a way that we found to engage campers and people that are RVing uh, to serve while they're on vacation or they're work camping. Yeah, this year alone, um, with those serve ambassadors, there'll be more than 75 events across the United States taking place. To be able to do that, is just truly humbling and we're excited to see where that grows. Can you talk a little bit about um, what Lipper does both for our own team members who may be facing hardship but then also for the communities in, in which we operate? Yeah, new for 2022, we actually decided to focus a certain amount of our funding for nonprofits in different communities that were focused on mental health. And then internally, we also launched our Lippert Cares Foundation. We have 15,000 people that are responsible for 15,000 families in general here. Um, and, you know, you never know when somebody's gonna have a, a serious uh, issue uh, in, in life that puts them into a, 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 a tough situation. In some cases, it's a difference between uh, you know, just giving people a, a feeling of, of ease that, hey, look, you know, something does happen and life happens to everybody. Nobody's immune uh, to, to tough situations in this world. So when it does happen, we'll, we'll be there to, to help out. Thank you everyone for all you are doing inside of your communities, inside of your plants to support fellow team members and also support community nonprofits or organizations that need it so badly. We are so excited to see what this year brings and how we can continue to be business as a force for good.